Though I am the baby number, I keep the team together as the team leader. In the history of math, my discovery allowed the other numbers to become more powerful by expressing values greater than nine. I love all things oval, including the Milky Way. And my favorite spot is the location where the prime meridian crosses the equator. I'm going to be a manager and team leader. I like the Mayan numbering system since it included a zero. And I can also tell you about how the Brahmi system traveled to Europe by the Arabs to create the base 10 system used worldwide today. I'm number one. I'm a bit boastful, but also lonely at times. I feel like I come from Mesopotamia, where the Babylonians recorded the first written numbering system using clay tablets and a stylus. Today, you can use your finger as the stylus on the electronic tablet. I love tall, skinny buildings. You may guess why. My favorite animal is the Arctic narwhal with its single long tusk. I like the shape of an egg with one point and one yolk. My goal is to be a politician, surgeon, or trial attorney. Sometimes the rest of the team has to tell me not to always run to the front of the line since I love to be first. I'm number two. I enjoy everything that comes in pairs, like camels with two humps. Since Rome was founded by the twin brothers Romulus and Remus, I like to talk about Roman numerals. I identify with the heart shape, with its two sides, and also because I am the empathetic member of the team. I will be a teacher or nurse when I grow up. I'm number three. I add stability to the team like triangles do to buildings. I love to talk about the great pyramids of Giza, the oldest standing structures created by humans. My favorite animal is the three-toed sloth from South America. I like the three blind mice, the three musketeers, and the three witches of Macbeth. I play the musical triangle. Since triangles are the sacred shape of architecture, I aspire to be a builder or architect. I'm number four, the team geek and proud of it. Because of my glasses with four sides, did you notice? Some folks call me four eyes. I love the painter Mondrian since his paintings include lots of rectangles and squares. I never get lost because I know the four directions. With four, the sacred number of the Navajo Nation, I like to tell the story of the Navajo Code Talkers. I will be an engineer, physicist, mathematician, or cartographer. A four fun fact you might not know. The four color theorem proves that all maps can be colored with only four colors. I'm proud to be number five. I love everything military, especially the U.S. Pentagon and all five-star generals. I also hang out with firemen to assist in opening Pentagon-shaped fire hydrants, and I use my five senses wherever I go. I like the logo of the Olympics because of its five interlocking rings. I enjoy tallying since it uses five marks, four dashes, and a fifth cross hatch mark as well as the Asian calculator based on fives called an abacus. I enjoy visiting Angkor Wat since it includes five center spires, a design known as a quincunx. My five-fingered hand sends you high five. I'm number six. I love crystals and hexagon-shaped items, snowflakes, beehives, and lots of floor tiles. 
I look forward to being a scientist and like to talk about Antarctica due to its ice cover as the frozen continent. I love chemical formulae with hexagons and remind all that carbon is the sixth element of the periodic table of the elements. I also like to compose music with my hexagon-shaped pencil and then play it on my six-stringed guitar. I raise bees and love to hunt for bugs with their six legs. Um, number seven, the team rogue from the seven seas. I wear a mustache and sail the seven seas looking for the seven ancient wonders of the world. I like that there are seven days of the week and that rainbows have seven colors. Did you know that the Statue of Liberty has seven rays on her crown to represent the seven seas and or the seven continents? I am the lucky number of the Western world as the most likely amount when a pair of dice is rolled. I like to recite the seven stages of man sonnet by Shakespeare. When I grow up, I'm going to be a real estate developer or entrepreneur as I like to take risks. I'm number eight. Since I'm the lucky number of China, I love everything Chinese, especially the Beijing Olympics, which started on 8-8-08 at 8-08-08 in the evening. My favorite animal is the octopus. I love stop signs since they are red octagons in shape and octagonal houses built in the United States and Canada during the 1850s. Sometimes I scare people with eight-legged spiders. I'm going to be an international trader as I love global business. I'm number nine. You know me as the team fashionista as I am always dressed to the nines. I always go the full nine yards and love cats with their nine lives. My favorite sport is baseball with its nine innings and team of nine players. I really like to visit Kowloon area of Hong Kong as it means nine dragons in Chinese. I also like to discuss the Kuipu not based numbering system of the Incas since it looks like jewelry. I aspire to be a fashion designer or model or lead a television reality show. Each of us has a favorite stringed instrument with the number of strings equal to our count. Zero plays a Native American drum. One, the Ektara from India. Two, the Urhu from China. Three, the balalaika from Russia. Four, the ukulele from the Hawaiian Islands. Five, the banjo from Africa brought to the United States with five strings. Six, the standard guitar from Spain. Seven, the buzuki from Greece. Eight, the mandolin from Italy. And nine, the kelstone from Belgium. Let's look at our favorite animals. Zero, the glass lizard. One, the Arctic narwhal, two, the Bactrian camel with two humps, three, the three-toed sloth, four, a darling little kitty with four paws, five, a starfish, six, honeybee living in a hexagon honeycomb, seven, seven-spotted ladybug, eight, an octopus, and nine, a nine-spotted moth. <laughs> 